हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू कोडिंग शिक्षा टुडे इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बी टेलिंग यू दैट हाउ टू कन्वर्ट द टेबल इन टू पी डी एफ यूजिंग जे एस पी डी एफ ऑटो टेबल लाइब्रेरी सो वी विल बी बिल्डिंग दिस इन एंगुलर सो दिस इज अ प्रोजेक्ट सो इफ आई हिट दिस डाउनलोड पी डी एफ सो इट विल जनरेट द टेबल फॉर मी इन पी डी एफ फॉर्मेट सो दिस इज अ सिंपल टेबल विच कंटेंट थ्री फील्ड्स नेम ई मेल एंड कंट्री सो वी विल बी बिल्डिंग दिस यूजिंग द ऑनलाइन आई डी ई विच इज कोड सैंड बॉक्स डॉट आई ओ सो जस्ट गो टू गूगल एंड टाइप दिस कोड सैंड बॉक्स एंड क्लिक ऑन द फर्स्ट लिंक and then you need to create the sandbox just click this and select angular so for this application we need two dependencies so we can just add here dependency so just drag down so just drag down and add dependency here let me just drag down just click add dependency and first dependency will be installing js pdf so this is the pdf document creation library so this you will need so just click it so after this we also need the js pdf auto table library so it will we just start downloading the library in the background so after this we will be needing the js pdf auto table we just drag down this so the next dependency we will add here js pdf auto table this is a library so just add this so after adding these libraries go to the app.component.html file which is there inside the app folder so here we will define our button so let me just delete all the code from it and give a heading that is js pdf auto table in angular close the heading and then we will be having a button type will be button this will be convert to pdf and also we will be binding a, a on click listener to it so just write this click listener we will attach so we will ex execute this function download pdf so you can see that the button is there so now we just need to go to the app.component.typescript file so here first of all we will be importing the js pdf and js pdf auto table so we'll just write here import star as js pdf from js pdf now we will be importing using the destructuring for importing this user options from js pdf auto table so now we just need to define a interface for js pdf auto table so just write here interface js pdf with plugin this extends js pdf So inside curly brackets you first of all define the auto table so just write here auto table colon 
instead of parentheses we write give the options colon user options and just we will write here jspdf so after defining this interface we will be defining the function that we have binded here in the app component.html that is download pdf so right here in the app component we need to define the function so this will download the pdf for us so just write download pdf so inside this first of all we will be creating a new instance of jspdf library so we will be declaring a document variable so we will initialize new jspdf so the first argument will be the type of document so this will be portrait comma the second argument will be pixel and the third argument will be the a4 size sheet so this is the way by which we can initialize and after that we just need to write as jspdf with plugin semicolon so now we just need to use the auto table function which is available in uh, jspdf so in order to convert tables into pdf so this is a function so basically this expects in the curly brackets you will write the head portion of the table so this takes a array so inside this array we will define our columns so first column will be name and the second column will be email and the third column will be country so this is the head portion of the table now we will define the body of the table just write body colon and this also takes a array so inside this array we will define the first entry in the array again so this is first is let me write david the name of the person then i will write the email address of the table let's suppose david at the rate gmail.com and the third con entry will be the country let's suppose sweden comma again i will define the another entry john let me suppose john at the date gmail.com and uh, let me define the country as usa and the third entry let me provide uh, gotham gotham at the rate gmail.com and the country let me provide India that's it guys so we have successfully defined the body as well so now our table is complete and now we just need to write a function which is uh, in order to save the PDF whenever we hit the button so for saving the PDF in JSPDF it is very easy just call this function save inside this you just need to name your PDF document let's suppose I name it as table.pdf that's it so now if I reload the application you can see that it is compiling so now if I hit convert to PDF a error is coming so let me just see JSPDF is not defined let me just see sorry guys this needs to be small here I have written capital so just make the adjustment JSPDF now if I hit the uh, talk dot auto table is not a function let me see what is mm, here we need to this auto table mm, 
let me see the original code just give me two minutes i uh, let me just see the original code which is which was there let me write code sandbox so here i i have created this project early on so i think that i am just committing a mistake let me just see the original code so in the app folder we have defined in the app component.ts so you can see that this is the original code so now let me just match it why it is not working oh, sorry guys we have not imported this uh, js pdf auto table library that is why it is not working so you can see that this one we need to import it we have not imported it so just right after this you just need to write here import js pdf auto table that's it so now if I reload it you will see that it is instantly uh, downloading the table for me so in, if I open this table.pdf you will see that all the entries are there name email country that we have defined so thanks so much guys for watching this video I will be seeing you in the next video